Have you ever been out and about and you saw something that caught your eye and you wanted to search on it but you didn't know quite what to type into Google? Well, in today's video, you'll learn how to use Google Lens on your iPhone so you can get the answers you need. So let's get started. Hi, it's Steve from It Makes Sense, where we give you the tools, the tips, and the strategies so you can start a YouTube affiliate marketing business because it just makes sense to have time and financial freedom. So if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring that bell notification so you don't miss any of my weekly videos. Recently, I was on a trip with my oldest son and we came across this plant that I thought might be poison ivy, but I wasn't entirely sure. Thankfully, I remembered that Google has a cool feature that Android users had available to them, but now iPhone users can use it too and it's called Google Lens. Google Lens is Google's visual search engine. So instead of typing something into Google, you instead use your camera's phone to do a search. So for instance, if I wanted to know more about this book and I point my phone at the book and ask Google Lens, what is this? You'll not only be told the answer, but you also get suggestions based on this object. To install Google Lens on your iPhone, all you need to do is go to the App Store and download the Google app. So let's go to the App Store, search for Google, and then you install it. So I've already downloaded it, so let me just download it again. All right, once it's downloaded, all I need to do is open it and then hit OK. Hit yes, turn on. Allow Google to, it's up to you if you want them to send you notifications. And then to use Google Lens, all you do is click on this little icon here and it asks you to if you want to let Google use your camera and you need to let Google use your camera otherwise you won't be able to use Google Lens. So I'm going to hit OK. So if I wanted to search on this tree, all I need to do is point my camera at the this plant, hit this little icon here, and it will search Google. And this is the exact plant that I have right here. And there are so many different ways you can use this, so many different objects. I think there's over a billion objects now that Google has indexed that you can use Google Lens. As this technology improves, you can expect that visual searches will become more mainstream. And Google Lens will be one of the tools that you can use whenever you're doing your keyword research for your content. And if you wanna learn more about how you can do YouTube keyword research, go check out this video right here. Or if you don't wanna watch that video, go watch this video down here, and that is a video that YouTube recommends. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.